Well, good afternoon, everybody. Hope everybody's doing well. And, uh, well, I got an unboxing there. I'm already a little uneasy about it. Well, I've been uneasy about it for days now, and I'll kind of go into the story. Well, this is the package. Does that box look even keel to you? I'm, I'm already nervous to open it. I'm not even going to put the description of what it is just because I want to build up the suspense. But here's the really interesting part. So if you look here, hopefully it comes in clear, you'll see that this package originated from New York. Now everyone here knows, well, if you don't, so what? I live in the DFW Metroplex. So you see that it was shipped out of New York, stopped in Jersey City, and it took a cross-country trip, and even across the Canadian border. I don't know if it was going to stop off over uh, where the heck. But then it even went to this uh, Sodotna, Alaska, before it was shipped back up to Anchorage, Alaska, and finally got to Fort Worth. That is nuts! The packaging is not good. The trip was long. I don't know. Do I dare? Wow. Clumsiness wins again. Anyway, picked you back up. Let's let's do this, eh? So <clears throat> anyway, the asking price on eBay was $476. It was from Boolean Exchanges. When I press the buy and now button, the status changed to last one. Now I hope this bad boy is intact. And at least they put it in some nice uh, econofoil there. Yeah, that's uh, paperwork. The rest of this is refuse. So yeah, we got package within the package. Hopefully the package was resilient. Yeah, I know. Whoever's not interested in watching me open up this thing, go ahead, fast forward. It's okay. I give you permission. Uh, uh, so hard. Life's so hard. First world problems. White man's burden. Uh, uh. Now don't get me started on my job. Uh, uh. Holy cow, these people really went out of their way. Like a quadruple bagger there. Well, the tube seems intact. All right, the big reveal. Cuckle doodle doo. This is what I've been telling you about, Ms. Lady Liberty Stacker. You sure you don't want to do a trade? Check her out. Lion Privy up there at the top. Let's see if I could get the details there. Probably as good as it's going to get with this iPhone camera. Yep. Looks like it made a safe journey across the nation. Worried for nothing, I guess. Yeah, that's just smear marks. Oy vey schmear. Little taco shout out. That is not milk spots. So anyway, yeah, $476 for a tube of 20. I'm not the, I mean, I, I like some of the Perth stuff and I got a little Perth here and there, but I never really went for any uh, Privy Mark Perth. So this is a first. And hey, $476. I think I went out, yeah, I went out on eBay to try to find the same product. And it was up to like $546, I think. 
These do have a limited mintage of 30,000. Now I did see these I think for like 23.50 to 24, and it might be a little less now with the spot. On uh, I think it was uh, blah, 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 uh, not Silvertown. It's that one Gainesville, yeah, you know where they rip you off on the shipping. So anyway, no fault of bullion exchanges on the shipping. The packaging, I really do have to wag my finger at you guys. Come on, for real, you know splurge a little bit more put it in a nicer box because you're kind of taking a chance there i mean this thing was up in alaska i mean who knows how this was handled apparently the usps handled it just fine well that's it for today i'm uh i got a couple more things on the way and if you watched my crappy uh vegeta deal video last night i'm sure you know what one of those things is but I do have a surprise on the way, and I will go into details why I decided to get it. But until then, have a great uh, Thursday, and I will see you all later.